Try again. Was that right, teacher? It's not how Mozart wrote it. Okay, let me try again. No, let's just, um, let's just take five. What are you doing? Nothing. You'll think it's stupid. Okay, never mind that. I'm typing the alphabet as fast as I can. And you do this for fun? Fun! <laughs> fun is for babies, teach. I'm in training. Training for... In the World Championships last summer, I tripped up on a queue and I got second place. <laughs> I'm not gonna let that happen again. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Well, how fast can you do it? I'm going for the record, teach. I don't practice eight hours a day for nothing, okay? Hold on, I thought you practiced the piano for eight hours a day. No, I said that I practiced for eight hours a day, never said what for. Ah! It is all coming together now. You know what, let's just end this early, okay? I gotta catch a flight to Moscow in two hours for the semifinals. Here is your check. This is just the alphabet. Ah, you keep talking to just that! What is going on with you? The grandmasters pulled me out of kindergarten so that way I could study with Boris Yotsimanov before he died. Are we still talking about the alphabet? Do you know the kind of pressures that you face when you're a child prodigy? When your parents force you to practice every single night or else they make you sleep in the stink tent in the basement. Did you just say stink tent? And all for what, teach? When you take away all the fame and the free typewriters and the tens of dollars in prize money, all I'm left with is this useless skill. Wait. What? Take your hands off the iPad. Okay. Now, type the alphabet. But there's no iPad here. I know. I'm doing it! I'm doing it! You're doing it! <laughs> Who knew that the ABCs on the United States QWERTY keyboard layout is the exact same finger replication of Mozart's Rondo Alaturka? Who would have thought? I'm flying! I'm on the moon, teach! High five, hoodie guy, come on, man! Yeah! Always remember this time. We all changed after that day. Hoodie Guy went on to learn the rest of Mozart's repertoire, win the ABC Championship, and then he got elected Pope. I don't know. Teach was drafted into the war and now suffers from a condition known as eternal bloodlust. And as for me, well, let's just say Jennifer Lopez still won't respond to my letters, even though I send one each and every day. And Jenny, I know you're watching because you subscribe to Daniel's channel and keep asking him to record a cameo for your birthday. Well, anyways, Jenny, I better wrap this up. You know where to find me right outside your house. Did you hear that? Eternal bloodlust? What is that? And now for the sketch after the sketch, brought to you by Harry's. What you doing? I'm shaving. Oh, you're probably gonna need some band-aids then, huh? No, I'm shaving with Harry's. Harry's? Yeah, Harry's have a high quality weighted handle, precision trimmer blade, and a flex hinge to follow the delicate contours of my face. Nice. And their foaming shaving gel is perfect for sensitive skin. Look at this, dude, no cuts. Okay, this is actually the smoothest shave I've had in a while. Sketch aside, this is really, like, this is actually really good. Well, you look great. And refills of their sharpest ever blades get delivered straight to your door for only two bucks, dude. Oh, what do you use? I've been using the same blade since high school, trying to keep it on the cheap. Here, check it. What? Fresh as a daisy. Redeem your trial set for just three bucks when you go to harrys.com slash Daniel Thrasher. You'll get a five blade razor, weighted handle, a travel cover, and their foaming shave gel. Did I mention it was three bucks? Because it's three bucks. Three dollars. Bibbidi bobbidi. Bibbidi bobbidi.